Uh, in this video, I'll show you how to import a SharePoint file, more specifically an Excel file that's hosted on a SharePoint site, into Power Query. The use case or scenario for this is if you have a file that you that's large or a file that's shared that somebody else downloads and puts it onto SharePoint, and you want to use that file as your source to do your transformations or your analysis, this is where we would use this type of steps to get that file in from SharePoint into Power Query. Here I'm a SharePoint site and I've got this file. I double click that and it's going to open up this file. And you might think all I need to do is take the URL up here at the top, copy that and use that as my source to bring into Power Query. Unfortunately, that process is a little bit convoluted but it's not too hard. So let's see what we need to do. The first thing we need to do is when we are in the web view of our Excel file, we need to open it up in the desktop app. So clicking in the open and desktop app, it'll open it up. And here we're going to go into file info to get the URL that we would need to pull it in from Power Query. Here we'll select copy path. And we can close out of this. I have a new workbook open, go to data from web and paste that copied URL into the field. Control V to paste. And you notice that there is a question mark web equal one. We just need to delete the question mark and anything after that. Click OK. And the navigator window will come up asking what we want to choose, the table or the sheet. There might be an instance where you need to sign in with your organizational credentials for the SharePoint. And the navigator window will come up. Data was my only worksheet there. Click transform. And I've pulled it in from that source. And so that's the way that we can do it. And now we have our file. We can do our transformations. Like if I wanted to make the first world's headers and then maybe just uh, have all filtering for females, click OK, and then we've got our file to deal with. So that's the way that we can import a file, bring in a file in, an Excel file in from SharePoint with Power Query. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.